le kituka mule, kituka mule le di pino. Kena le mwaka tataro, kibeta komedi marabo. Bizo la me kibo felo, kibata kutona le tempo, kibata kutona kalefo. Kispana kachata kitindo, kispana kachata kitindo, kispana kachata kitindo, kispana kachata kitindo, kitindo, kitindo. Gap City, B Dub, Africa, the rest of the world. Welcome to the Juice 2.0, your favorite show. And today we're hanging out with someone who has a lot of things, plenty of things in common with Beyonce. But one thing really stands out: they are both female versions of a hustler. While Beyonce raps all the divas in the United States, she represents all the divas in Gap City. And maybe one of these good days, the whole country. She's. Habroni's favorite party girl. She's also an events and marketing manager. On top of that, she's a radio personality, I'm told. And one of the most fantastic hosts I've actually ever come across. Also a very big foodie. Joanne Richardson is in the building. Gabs, Diva, and good morning. Welcome to the show. Good morning. Hi. Hi. <laughs> What an introduction. Yeah. <laughs> did, it, did it do justice? Yes, to? it did. It yeah. did. It did. I worked on it the whole night. Thank you. I had to. For putting in the effort. Right? <laughs> on, on the mirror and doing my thing. <laughs> Only thank for you. the most important people, Joanne. Oh, thank you. Thank How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Yeah? I'm good. I'm good. How are you? I'm great. I'm great. I'm just glad that you're here because, like I was t- uh, telling you off air, Right. If you're able to wake up this early in the morning, my goodness, then I can appreciate your time so much because it's not a lot of people that are able to wake up in the morning. No, and, and I'm not it. a morning person at all. Yeah. No, I'm a night crawler. I'm a lady of the night. <laughs> <laughs> the lady of the night I is do in the not building. Do morning at all, at all, at all. So then, that is a testament. I always say this too to how you viewed this whole platform, and you said it's very important that I go chill with yes, TK. Yes. 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 I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank for you real, for, for thank you for inviting me as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So so you didn't want to come through at first. You're like I'm a, time. I'm, I'm a shy. Oh, you also spoke about being shy. I'm like yes, Gab's I am. diva is not shy. Yeah, you were like, What? Like, Shh, no, <laughs> no, no. But I can be shy actually. I can. Yeah, how are you feeling right now? I'm fine. You're good. I'm nervous, but I'm fine. All right, nerves are good. <laughs> As long as that. So you are Gab's diva. Yes. Right? Real name Joanne Richardson. Joan. Joan. Yes. <sighs> Joanne. Moan alone, Joan. No. You had me. You had me a moan. <laughs> Most people actually catch on to the name as soon as I say that one. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Moan. <laughs> oh, Joan. Oh, Joan. okay. I get it now. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah. Why don't we talk, to Joan? It's too early in the it's morning. It's too early in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> So Kim, Kim would have crucified me for saying that, right? Uh-huh. Yeah, because she she'd always say you're out of order and it's early in the morning. So I'm allowed to. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll stop. You're you're I'll allowed stop. to. You're allowed. <laughs> sex talk is beautiful talk. I enjoy talking about sex. Yeah. Yes. When was the last time you spoke about sex with who? Jeez, we just got into this interview. I mean, we I went mean- all the way left. <laughs> uh, I spoke about sex last night with my girlfriend. Ah, how long have you been with your girlfriend? I was told about your girlfriend by my girlfriend last uh, night. From TikTok video? He's, yeah. He's, <laughs> she's like, dude, you're having an interview with Joan tomorrow. I was like, yeah. It's like, dude, I don't know why Joan has been coming up on my Twitter, on my TikTok <laughs> yes. uh, page. And it's her with her girlfriend. I was like, wait, Joan is dating a girl? Yes. I was like, oh, man, tell me about that. When did this happen? <laughs> oh, man, I'm so interested in this. This is juicy You're stuff. You're making me blush. <laughs> You're making me blush. Uh, it will be five months on Monday. Five months. Yes. Um. Yeah, she came along and she made me happy and we're doing this thing. Congrats, man. Thank you. So the brothers that are trying to get with you, you're like, no, no, not over here. No, no, I'm, 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 I'm done. <laughs> They have broken my heart. They have taken me to Sabrana and back. You know, I have groveled yeah, yeah. at the lowest. So no, I'm done. You're not doing that anymore. But I don't think it's about being with a man or a woman. I just think she came along and she just made me happy. I think yeah. even if five months ago a guy had come along and made me happy, it would have just been it the same been thing. The yeah. same thing. Yeah, it's not really about her sex. Yeah, I like that. Congratulations on the five months. Thank you. And I hope that, and I wish that it's more than five months. It becomes years and years and years. I hope so. She makes me very happy. And people yeah. that have seen us together, my friends and my family, they think they've never seen me this happy. Yeah, yeah. And it's a consistent happiness. It's, I like that. I think when you're dating a guy, especially in Khabarone, 
Yeah. It's it's an up and down. It's a bit of a roller coaster. Gab City. <laughs> and, Gab City. And you're never really sure. You're always sort of on your toes a bit. Yeah. yeah. So I think but I thought ladies they, apparently love that about gentlemen that keep them on their toes. Contra distinguished to the I guys. I think when that you're are, younger, you enjoy the game. I think when you get a little ah, bit older, you're just like, let's just be happy and content and consistent. Yeah. yeah. So I think maybe because she's a woman, she gets it. And yeah, it's been, it's, I mean, we haven't had an argument. Yeah. Oh, for f- five months? We've never had an argument. Wait, is that a good, bad thing? I say, to her, I tell her that it's a bad thing because I five think that the day no that she blows up, it's going to go crazy. Yeah. But I think there's a level of respect and that's why there hasn't been an argument. We're able to oh, talk yeah. about something before it gets into a big thing. I like that. I like that. Well, like I said, congrats, more years to come. We'll talk so much more about, what's her name again? Uh, Sunshine. So- Real name? No, <laughs> I call her Sunshine, and that's what everybody knows her as. Sunshine. <laughs> yes. Shout out to you, Sunshine. She's probably listening right now. I hope so. Definitely listening. <laughs> Shout out to you, Sunshine. We appreciate you so much for making Joan this happy. Yeah. Cause you got a glow on you. Yeah. You got a glow on you. <laughs> we'll talk about exactly what you're talking about last night with Sunshine. Oh, no. About sex. <laughs> but for now, for now, why gaps, diva? Cause, cause this is. What you're passionately known around the circles and gabs as, yes. where did that come from? Coincidentally, as you introduced me with yeah. the Beyonce thing, yeah. um, when I was turning 18, uh-huh. I was already on the, on the streets of gabs. I was already, you know, yeah. known and right. I had a birthday party at Bull and Bush uh-huh. and I was, I was turning 18. And at the time, the biggest song was Diva by Beyonce. By Beyonce. And um, I had my birthday party and like 600 people came. I mean, it was wild. 600? Yeah, it was Dude. really, really wild. With just local DJs. Like yeah. nothing, nothing, no, no international acts. And um, someone that night just said to me, oh, we're no Gibbs d <laughs> And it stuck. It stuck. Literally, that's the story. And it just stuck. And I mean, I've never looked back and I probably owe that person a lot of money yeah, for giving me course, that name. <laughs> and I took it and I ran with it. And yeah. I mean, I've, I'm so grateful for the journey that it's given me yeah, and the yeah. brand that it's become. So I like I'm, that. So I'm really, really happy with that. So Gab's Diva, you're you're such a diva. I've I think the fondest memory that I have of you, right? And I'm thinking this is probably the first time that we met. I don't know if you remember. I probably won't. I yeah, probably, probably won't. won't. It's been a- <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're working. But you know, there's alcohol involved. When you're working. Yes. Give me your I'm a job. Party girl. Give me I get your paid job. to party. Give me your job. I get Joan. paid to make you guys have fun. We'll talk about that too, yeah, right? The yeah. setup that, because uh, I imagine a lot of young ladies want want your job because yeah. you get to have fun. And I've seen your pictures and your photos on Instagram. Yeah. Oh, you look like you're having the most fun <laughs> in the whole world. It's like, just look at that face. Yes. Our flyer for this show yes. and you come and just looked. You're like, <laughs> I'm like, there's happiness right there. Thank you very much, sunshine. <laughs> You did the things. You did the things, sunshine. So the fondest memory is... We're at a club, right? Mm-hmm. You're hosting, mm-hmm. right? I think five, six years ago or not. I'm, I'm not too sure anymore. So then I step out to you, right? Because I've always wanted to do this radio, this, this, that. Always practice in the mirror, blah, blah, blah. So you're holding the mic and you're hosting at this club, right? Then I come to you. I'm like, hey, hi. Uh, can I just like do 10 minutes or like five minutes of saying stuff and hosting as well? And you know, you were so very kind. You gave me the mic without knowing me. You gave me the mic and I did about a few seconds into it and I got shy. Uh-huh. I was like, you know what? Thank you very much. But we'll try this another time. But you know what? I, I remember that very vividly because you were such a kind person to a stranger who had a dream about certain things. Do you get that a lot, even up to now, about yes, people approaching you when you're hosting? I do. A lot, a lot. I do. But... I think in in a position where, like you say, that it was me being kind to you yeah. was because I was also given that opportunity when I wanted to start emceeing and uh, when I wanted to start hosting. You know, you don't go to school for this. You don't. Um, you and really it's just, don't. it's a born talent. And, and it's a confidence. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah. Uh, and maybe an it factor, an X factor. But, pe- you know, Easy B gave me a chance on an HCC sp- uh, stage in mm, Mahalat before the first mm, time to emcee. Mm. And I was just, you can imagine, and this is... How old were you? How old were you? Oh, like in my twenties. Yeah, 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 in my twenties. Yeah, right. And I, I, I just couldn't even imagine. And then, um, with with Cigar Lounge, yeah, uh, Pedro just sort of said the owner. He just said, you know what? Let's do this MC thing. Right, right. Because I, I was hired to manage. Right, right, right. Not necessarily MC. 
And it just blew up. It blew and I mean, up. It absolutely blew up. And I think within the fact that I was with the nightclub and I was also on radio. Right, right. The combination of the two just it was it like, blended, it, yeah, just, yeah. it was just fire, and so many, so many guys and girls would come up to me and say, "Please, can I do this with you? Please, yeah, can I?" Yeah. And obviously, you can't give the mic to everybody because you're of course, at work. Of course, people are having fun. They don't want to be listening to some random person. That, that happened to me. <laughs> that happened to me the other time. I was hosting a birthday party some two weeks ago. Yeah, right. And I need you to almost kind of relate to this and tell me if it's happened to you. Uh, the feelings that I had. Yeah. I'm on the stage doing my thing and then I get off stage. Some guy comes. He's like, yo, bro, you know, can I hype the people for like 10 minutes? In my mind, I'm like, so what you talking about my job? Did I do a bad job <laughs> enough to, for you to come over to me? You want to you wanna do a better job? So I was, unlike you, I was not the kindest person. <laughs> I kept pushing him off. It's like, you know what? Hey, man, I'll give it to you later. I'll give it to you later. He kept coming and kept coming. But it got to a point where it was a bit annoying. I was like, bro, I got hired to do this. Yeah. I'm getting paid to do this. Yeah. The person they want to do over there, they want to see over there is me. Yeah. So if they see someone else, it's going to be like, yo, bro, what did we hire you for? Yes. Has that happened? Has those feelings Lots ever come? Lots of times. <laughs> Lots of times. And I get so offended by that because I take it like, am I not doing this right? Exactly. Is there exactly. a problem here? I, I get very, very offended. And I think, with my with my personality and my face, yeah. people can just see what I. Hey, yeah, it's not happy. Yeah, um, but yeah, it's happened. But you can also understand that there are those people that are that confident that feel yeah. that they can do a better job, yeah. and sometimes they actually can. Sometimes they can. Yeah, you just they it's, just it's also hard. need that platform as well. And it's really really hard to see who is who, you know, in a moment, and it's a crowd. Yes. Eight thirteen is your time. Gabs Diva is in the building. We're just hanging out and catching the conversation. It took a left side real quick before we went, when we just started. <laughs> But we'll try to settle down. But hey, man, who has time to settle down? No. Right? Nobody no, has time to no. do that. Be back after Ben T and William Last, KRM. Beautiful, beautiful music. That's B Dub, homegrown, home manufactured, and home brewed. Be back. That's that blue, black, and white, baby, the way you love it. We're getting a message over here that says, Shout out to Joan. She's killing it in the entrepreneurship. Yamostrate. You know, I was like, Joan, apparently you're killing it in Thank the streets. You. In Thank the streets. You. Thank you. Yeah. Get Thank us you. more messages on that number. That's plus 267-395-6962. And for your SMS is 14962. If you want to call us live and direct, also ask Joan a few questions, want to comment on whatever she's saying. Or, you know, just also be good early in the morning. You can call us on 395-6962. Joan, we're back. What were we talking about? Remind me. <laughs> <laughs> Everything. <laughs> Everything and anything, right? So so then you as a host, you've always been able to monetize it for the years that you've been doing it. Which is how many years now, Joan? Uh, 12, since I was 18. Damn. 12 years. So, so then when does Yarana FM get involved? Uh, blah, 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 blah. Six, six years ago. Six years? Yeah. And it ran for how long? Six years. Six years. On and off. On and off. They fired me and they brought me back. <laughs> and then they fired me again when COVID happened. What did you do? To... What did you do? Uh, should I be honest? Uh, just don't get us in I'll trouble. I'll be diplomatically honest. Don't get us in trouble, yeah. I won't put you in trouble. Uh, right. I think the, the the manager that was there at the time, yep. Nasan Fili. Ah, right. And then they got a new manager. Right. And then and then that manager said, no, Bruh, no, come back. Boomerang, bring come it back. back. Come back. <laughs> so yeah. tell me, tell me about being on radio. What was that for you about? Because I know what it is for me, right? It's it's oh my goodness. I'll talk about me, but you're here because we need yeah. to hear from you. How was how is radio for you? You know, when I started radio, yeah. I before before I actually even got on radio, I mm -hmm. had wanted to do it. And I had wanted to do it simply for the fame. Right, right. I thought being on radio at that time was the coolest thing. It was celebrity on 100. Ah. I thought. So when I got on, I was still on that, yeah. that mode. Until you actually now sit on the desk <laughs> and you must learn and you must prep. Yeah. And you must. And, and you must watch your words. Of course. Of course. And then I was like, hmm, maybe this is actually not what I want. Yeah. But for some weird, weird reason, like I'm saying, I was fired. I brought back. Uh -huh. And I was there for six years. I, with no knowledge of yeah. it. Just, yeah. you know, thugging it out. Right, right. And the amount of 
people that I met through it, the amount of people that got to know me through it, it yeah. um, the conversations that I had with strangers on radio. It is such a blessing and it yeah, was such a yeah. platform and such a privilege yeah. to have been on. And I would never, ever take it back. I would never go back yeah. on radio. I'd never go back on radio. I'd probably do like a podcast. Why wouldn't you go back on radio? Is it because of the limitations of radio that you've spoken about or... That's just, just not your thing. I don't think it's my thing anymore. And I think it's served its purpose and it's time ah, to move on. And there's, yeah. there's there's more people that I think would value it more. Right, right, than, right. Than, than you me. would right now. Yeah, so rather give that space to them. So then you did meet a couple of amazing people, right, yeah. during the journey. Does that now fuel your events and marketing? Uh, yeah, the events and marketing was first. That yeah. was already existing. Oh, great. Um, so obviously when you merge them and, and and the club and the restaurant come together and yeah. they also then become sponsors onto the show, onto yeah. the radio show. Um, and we have these, these uh, international DJs that are coming into the show as well. Yeah. And obviously, when I'm at the club or at the restaurant, people just recognize the voice. Yeah. And, they rec- and then they, they'll see You do face. have a radio voice, though. <laughs> Thank you. You have that radio. A lot. Such a radio voice. <laughs> and they don't come by so easily, these radio voices. I've heard that. I've yeah. heard that. Yeah. I've heard that. So, yeah, the two really, really meshed very, very well. Mm-hmm. And um, I think when you look at the, the growth of Gab's Diva. Yeah. I think that definitely that radio platform definitely helps. I like that. Yeah. A little bit back into the radio issues, right? Yeah. Uh, then we'll move quickly along. BW Radio. Where is it now? Are you happy with it when you tune into this station, that station, this station? Could it improve? And if it could, what could it improve on? That's oh, a bit of a difficult question, but... It's a loaded question. I'm not sure you want my truth. <laughs> Okay, one, I don't listen to what's on the radio. See, there you go. That, Joan, <laughs> come on. I don't listen to what's on the radio. I will listen to shows. Like, I'll listen to your show. I'll listen yeah. to Miss GK's. Right. I will listen to Dollar Mac. Right, right. Because I know you. Right. But I will never just switch just on radio. Switch on get, the radio. I get lazy. Ah. No. But I think as well as that, obviously, there is... Uh, an empowerment that the radio stations are trying to push local music. Yeah, yeah. And I don't think that local music is of the standard okay. that it, it should could be, get to. Yeah. That you could listen to it the whole day. Yeah. So for instance, I've been very public that I listen to YFM in mm-hmm. South Africa mm-hmm. every day, all day, without a doubt. And they also push South African music yeah. as a, 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 at a bigger percentage. Yeah. But the music quality is better. And that's why we book these South African artists. Yeah. South African artists it must be for a reason. Must be for a reason. South Africa are not booking us here to go and perform. There must be a reason. There's a reason for that. So I, I, no, I don't listen to what's on the radio. And it's sad because when you listen to South African radio, it's, it's nice. It's, 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 it's amazing. You know what? I quit. <laughs> this is my, guys, it was, it was great. It was great doing this radio thing for three years, but uh, I quit. I quit. This no, is, this please is don't it. quit on my account. Please don't. <laughs> but I understand and I appreciate the honesty. You know what I mean? We could improve one on the music, obviously. Right. But are you also worried about the talent on air? Do we have radio talent in B-Dub? I think we used to. We used to. Yeah. Ooh, who's coming to your mind right now? No, I'm not going to oh, say. Oh, come on. Do you want to get me into trouble? Please, come on. No, I'm not going to say. I'm not going Just to say. Just one name, John. No. No. Okay, I'll say Lungo. King B. Lungo, yeah. 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 Lungo is dope. He was amazing. He yeah. Was am- but Lungo is amazing at everything that he does. I mean, when he touches something, it turns to gold. Yeah. And when it's Gabs FM, did you used to listen to... Uh, uh, da, 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 you don't even remember. That's how irrelevant the person was. No, no, no. They were really... <laughs> <laughs> shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Sheesh. <laughs> Why am I forgetting this name? Super relevant. Current issues. Political. Controversial. Oh my goodness. You see. It'll come. Kim, try and help him. It'll come. Sheesh. Do you know? Gab's a femme. A guy or a girl? A gentleman. Oh my goodness. Anyway, the listener will remind me because I know they, okay. they know who I'm talking about. Uh, okay, so Lungo, then my. O'Neill. That was O'Neil. when I started. That's when, you know, that's when the radio had started coming up. O'Neill. Bonnie. Bonnie. Yeah. Um, Miss B. Miss B. Yeah. You know, those are no. people that you really, I really looked up to when I wanted to do radio. Yeah. And they were celebrities. Like when they walked into a place, you were like, hey. just like, hey. yeah. the, the atmosphere has changed. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, Bonnie's great. Ooh, Bonnie's great. Yeah. Bonnie's great. Uh, Gabriel is great. Uh, who else? Dollar Mac. Dollar Mac. Um, Simba Mudere. No. Do you remember Simba? No. Do you know Simba? I'm not sure. It's not coming. A, a face is not coming to my mind. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, but so clearly we can do so much to improve this and that on talent. Ooh. And the reason why you're not listening to B Dub Radio nowadays is because the people that used to do it for you have now left. They're not. But obviously them. they and they had their time, and now there's an, a younger person that will come That'll in. That'll come in and uh, so. Th- and that's just the circle of life. It is what it is. Yeah. It is what it is. And um, sometimes you don't want to hold on to things too long, right? No, you don't. I yeah. mean, there's, there's, I think, two, one, one or two yeah. um, radio person that are still on radio. And you're just like, yeah. why are you still on radio? <laughs> why are you on a youth radio station when you're an old man? Uh, it's time up. Time, <laughs> time is up. You know? So, but I mean, I, I don't take away their talent. I don't of take course, away their talent. Of course. But I just think also... Know when it's time to walk out of the room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. John, we're going to play a little game called... Uh, I got a little help from Kim over here. Okay. It's titled Follow My Lead. Right? Okay. You simply have to start a sentence with the last word that I used on my sentence. Okay. Okay. Right? Radio doesn't suck. <laughs> you knew that what was going to... You knew! <laughs> I, you know, I was going to get in trouble for that one. Do a different sentence with a different word. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Um. Oh, no. <laughs> My bad. It was going to be explicit. It, it was going to be really that. Yes. Yeah. Good morning to you all. All of me is very happy to be here. Here goes Joan speaking about this and that. <laughs> That's what I do, boo. Boo thing. <laughs> all right, I'm failing. <laughs> Boo thing. What is that? <laughs> All right, you go first. I'll try to take it after you. Um, who are you dating? Dating <laughs> is such a terrible thing. <laughs> thing about it is, we'd like to know how happy the person makes you. You <laughs> are <laughs> such a beautiful heart, is what I'll tell my girlfriend. Okay. Girlfriends are amazing people. People <laughs> could literally bring sunshine. <laughs> yeah, we had to. Yeah. We had to. <laughs> sunshine on a cloudy day. Sunshine on a cloudy day. <laughs> and I'm hoping that's what you feel this morning on the Juice 2.0 828 chilling with Gab's Diva. Joan is in the building. So on the count of three, ee, ee. one, two, three. Ee, ee. <laughs> ah, there you go. <laughs> Okay. Caught you off guard. Yes, you did. My bad. <laughs> 833 is your time. Gab's Diva is in the building. We're just chilling. We're just chilling. Yeah, it's a nice conversation. It's just chilling, yeah. This yeah. is how I prefer my radio, you know? Not interview, just conversation. Just having you know what a chat. I mean? So what do you want to ask me? Um, Uh-oh. How long are you going to be on radio? I have two questions. How long are you going to be on radio? It's not going to be more than three years. What is the end game with you being on radio? It used to be about fame. <laughs> At least I'm you so and I, happy that you've said that. You would not, you would not share that. You know what I mean? No other radio personality has ever admitted to yeah. nobody. It used to Thank be about you. fame. I gotta be on radio for fame. Yes. And then when I met the person that gave me a job, I told him the same thing, right? And then they were like, "You gotta have something to say, man. Yes. We're not gonna just give you an opportunity just." That's very so it used true. to be about fame, but for now, I I wanna make bag. So this platform is supposed to help me with other other businesses that yes, I'm that's about to open, does. and uh, just create a channel into it. You know? And what is the, the, the what's the channel like? What's the end game here? It's advertisement. Okay. Yeah, that's the end goal okay. actually. So having your own advertising agency. Yep. Oh, well consultancy done. slash agency. Yeah. Okay. So I should meet the right people. Exhibit A, right here. <laughs> And one of those good days when the agency comes up, it should it should be easier because of the platform that this radio has brought for me. So, I understand. and I wish you all the best in that. Thank you very much. Yes. Thank you very much. And I think I think radio is beautiful because then the people that you meet, number one, right? You would think that people are not listening to radio, but people are listening to radio. I had one good friend of mine refer me to a lady that was listening, and she wants to do business, right? And I had thought, this was like a year and a half ago, and I had thought no one is listening to my show, right? So then they approached me with a business proposal, 
We did it in Maung. It was beautiful. Mm-hmm. And that's just from a person who listened and thought, I could work with this guy. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it's all about people. Radio is all about people and specifically one person who's listening right yes. now. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. What do you want to talk about, dude? It's your show. But no, it's not my show. That was the, two, the question. How long do you want to be on radio and what's the end game? Yeah. Yeah, those are the two questions. Yeah. And um, what else can I ask you? Uh... Don't be too deep. Don't. I don't know. That's the thing. Like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. What do you prefer doing socially? Ooh. So I'm, I think I'm growing up, right? Okay. How old are you now? How old do you think I am? 28. Wow. For real? And then what is. <laughs> <laughs> how old are you? 31. 31. Yeah. Okay. Wait, how old are you? I'm turning 31. You're turning two, two, three weeks. Oh! What's the plan? What's the plan? Oh, there's going to be a big, big party. We're announcing on Monday, which yeah. I'm very, very excited for. Maybe Tuesday because I don't want to take the limelight away from Sunshine on Monday. Oh, yeah. But <laughs> we're having a very big party at uh, what, what is dubbed as Club Sibele. Oh, of um, course. Yes, yeah, so we're going to have a very big party with some, with some DJs and... It's, it's a standard Gab's Diva birthday party I like you know, that. from the beginning. When I turned 18, yeah. every year a club has always hosted me. So I need you to put your headsets because. Okay, uh, okay we lost okay. it. We had a Sorry. phone call. Please try to call us back, 395 <laughs> 6962, and let's hear what you have to say. Happy birthday is in order, man. Number yes. one invitee on that party, at that party, for yeah, that party. Yeah, it's open to everybody. No, but I want to be in the VIP. There is no VIP because it's a restaurant, remember? Can we not create a VIP? No. We can't do that. Okay. No. Okay. All right. And I, I and that's one thing that I love about my brand is that yep. as much as it's a lifestyle brand, yep. it's also, I don't, I like to interact with people and I don't ah, like to be secluded. Somewhere else. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Also, the VIPs in Gap City are not the best VIPs. I've had worse, I've had worse VIP experiences before. But I can tell you that when you see these events in South Africa where like a VIP ticket is like 500, 350 yeah. rand. Yeah. Our VIPs. Yeah. Way better. For real? Way better. Oh, okay. Way, way better. You had a different experience right mm-hmm. there. Way, way better. Okay. Never have I ever hooked up with the DJ from South Africa while working. I've never. Give me something to drink. I've never, <laughs> <laughs> I've never when, ever. I'll never ever mix business off, with pleasure. Man. Yeah. I'll never mix business with pleasure. At all, at all? Never. Never have I been macked on by a DJ from South Africa while I was working. Of course. All the time. Of course. Ooh, who was it? Who was it? Lots. Oh, come on. Give Lots. me names. Names. Nope. Come on. Nope. I work with these people. <laughs> Get the female live on air. Good morning. Good morning, sir. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? You're speaking to Conrad. Conrad, what it is, sir? Easy chilling, man. TK, I just wanted to, to comment on what you said earlier, you know, about radio. And I think I love what you're doing, man. And I just had to call in and say, dude, I've known you for years. And yeah, I love what you're doing. Keep being you. Keep being awesome, man. Oh, man. Thank uh, you so much, bro. Yeah. We don't yeah. Have- and I think that's just some people who, you know, you say the radio personalities. I think you're just one of the people that are just so passionate about your job. And I see you, man. Shout out to you, bro. Appreciate you so much. We don't have too many tissues in this building, man. What you trying to do? <laughs> <laughs> now nah, we got to give people their flowers while yes. they're alive, man. That's appreciate you, Conrad. Good, man. Like, I, I appreciate what you're doing. I appreciate your work. And every chance I get, I get to tune into your show. Sometimes I don't call in, but... Yeah. And I think even sometimes we bump into each other, you know, at gym, yeah, out, yeah. out and about, you know, we never get to say, hey, man, I see you and I see what you're doing. Keep being you, man. Man, I'm humble. Thank you very much, my brother. Appreciate you so much. So, cheers, buddy. One time. Enjoy your day. Thanks, bro. No. 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 Joe and your scarf. Your scarf. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> well done. Right? That's a big, big compliment. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Big compliment. See, these are the things that keep you going, right? That motivate you. Whenever, yeah, motivation. That's the right word. Ooh, who's that song? Motivation and... Uh, Kelly Rowland. Oh, yeah. Not what was happening last night, was it? <laughs> Sunshine. Mm-hmm. Look at you blushing. <laughs> Joan. Are we done with this conversation? <laughs> oh, far from done. <laughs> No, she makes me blush. Even now. She yeah. Makes me blush. So you're a foodie, I'm yes. told, right? Let's talk about that, man. Yes. What is this fascination about food? 
Obviously, one, I'm a big girl, so I've always liked food. But yeah. two, um, you know, 2009, I didn't even know how to fry an egg. Did not even know how to fry an egg. How old were you in 2009? Uh, Let's calculate that. Some 20 or 19, 18, somewhere 18, there. 19, yeah. yeah. You didn't know how to fry an egg. Didn't no judgment, egg. but yes, judgment. I grew up with people doing it for me. Wait. <laughs> Hold on. No, let's not go into that one. Okay. But, um... So I dated somebody And they were like Listen We can't be eating At restaurants every day All the time Yeah so yeah Learn how to cook Right and I, and I learned how to cook And I'm so grateful For that And Again I've money I've money Money to rise money, yeah. money I've made money off it <laughs> <laughs> And um, If you know the, 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 the Facebook page Foodies Botswana Yes I, yes I, They did a show Last year Yeah I hosted it as well Yeah was Bakes, Bakes, Bakes there? No. Bakes, Bakes, Bakes said something about being on Foodies with Twitter or something like that. I don't remember exactly what he said. But anyway. Yes, continue. he posts. He participates. Oh, he posts. Yes, but ah. on the show that they that they had recorded, no, he wasn't on it. Dope, okay. Yes. Um, and Bakes really supports uh, my, my, my source business very, very much. Yeah, Bex is an awesome dude. He's amazing. He's always reposting my stories. Have you ever met such an amazing person in your life? And he was in the building the yes, other time. Yes, I saw. Yeah? I saw. I saw. It's just once in a lifetime does God bless us with such personalities. I mean, whenever I bump into Bakes, it's just happiness. Yeah. I mean, the first time he came to my house to come and collect um, the sauces, we stood outside for like 30 minutes. And it was like a <laughs> chat, like we've known each other forever. Yeah, yeah. And every single time he's since come again to come and buy, right. we just have a chat. Ah, dope, man. He's such a nice person. And whenever I see him, you know, and I always tell him that he, yeah. he'll reach for the stars. We bumped into each other during New Year's in Joburg. Yeah. And then we spent the weekend together just like that. Look at that. And I convinced him to stay for longer. And he was <laughs> he was flying back that day. And I was like, no, don't leave. Don't leave. Don't, don't do you that. Know, and he stayed. And we had so much fun. Which other person gives you that kind of vibe in B-Dub, in Gabs? Apart from Sunshine. Drew Chadhall. Drew. And Bobosti's boy Samuel. Oh, Future yeah. CEO. Oh, my goodness. Those two. Those two. Drew is amazing. He's such a talent. Drew, man. Drew, I love his selection of music, by the yes. way. Yes. Anyway, let's go back to the food. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> yes. We digress. Back to the food. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I cook and, and I post. And that's, yeah, so I started learning how to cook. And then I started posting it and started looking pretty. And then I started, you know, posting it. And, and it's just blown up yeah. in itself. Yeah. And obviously, my friends would say to me, Sell this, sell this, sell this, and that's how I ended up uh, with my with my with my own yeah restaurant, if you will, right, right. kitchen, yeah, right. Um, and I had to close down because of COVID, but uh, yeah, I love it and I enjoy it, and I, I, th it's a love language for me. I yeah. enjoy cooking for people. I enjoy making them happy. That's nice. Yes. What are we cooking for, TK? One of those good days. What would you like? Um, I'm a ish. I suck when it comes to that question, right? Because I pretty much eat everything and anything. Oh, like what if your mom were to cook you something? What yeah. would you want her to do? Oh, uh, that'd be that pop. Uh-huh. Mixed with uh veggies mi mixed with beef stew. That's like the, like the Zimbabweans the, love this meal. Yeah. It's they pop love, and oh man. Beef stew with with, with, with the Morocco spinach. and yeah. the spinach mixed, mixed together. Yeah. This, oh Jesus is Lord. Do you know Victor Jamere? Yeah, of he course. He passed away. He, he did, yeah. Live, yeah. Rest in peace. We were very good friends. Uh -huh. Very, very good friends. And he introduced me to this meal. Yeah. And and I, and I thought it was weird because but we don't cook like that. Yeah, yeah. We put it on the side. Yeah, yeah. We and love mixing just, it. Yeah, and I was just like, this is weird. But it was so amazing. <laughs> it was so good. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. It, it, that's, that's one of my favorite dishes. So, you're going to do that for I us? I will one of make good that days? for you one day. I will. That's what's, a promise. What's your favorite though? Oxtail and dumplings. Ugh. And morocco. I, oh. I am I'm in love with spinach. Oh my goodness. Yeah, oxtail and lasagna. Oh yeah? Done well. Yeah. Done well. And anything that is seafood. Yeah. yeah. From Lucky Star to caviar. Do you have do you have siblings? I'm interested to know that. Do you yes, have siblings? I do have siblings. It is her birthday today. today. Uh, what's her number? What's her phone number? <laughs> we got her. All right. Give it's us her a, birthday today. Yeah. Let's give us give us a second. We'll be back right after this. We're calling one of uh, Joan's sibling to wish them a happy birthday. Stay tuned. Happy, 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 <laughs> happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Thank you. What up, what up Hannah? How you doing? 
I literally just woke up. <laughs> yeah, Joan is very, very bad. Joan is calling you in the morning on radio, wishing you a happy birthday. Joan oh is bad. <laughs> oh my God. I was the first one to call her this morning at midnight. Aww, yeah. Thank you so much, Joan. You're welcome. <laughs> How you doing, honey? Happy birthday, man. I need to get up, wake up, and get this day started. Of course. You know how old she's turning? Yeah, how old are you turning today? Uh-uh. 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 It's like, hold up. <laughs> it's not happening? No. It's not happening. <laughs> However many years you're turning today, God bless you, and uh, have a blast today, yeah? Thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much. <laughs> All right, cheers. Bye. <laughs> That's uh, Joan's sister turning some years today. She's yeah. younger, yeah? No, she's older than me. She's older than you. She's older than me. I'm thinking 34. No! Way older. No, no, no. She's turning. She's turned. Yeah. 1987. Okay, 36. Actually, my math is just, yeah, yeah. Uh, she eight. said 35, and I said that because she had a huge party last year, so I couldn't quite understand. <laughs> she did say 30, and I was like, no. No, it's She okay. had a huge party last year. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah, well, right. happy birthday to you, Hane. Appreciate you so much. 848 is your time. More of Joan after a musical break. Dude, this song that I'm about to play mm-hmm. is from Posebina. Okay. What is your fondest memory of her? Because I know you brush shoulders. I think she's amazing. Yeah. I think she is so talented. She is probably one of the top three yeah. most talented artists, artists in yeah, Botswana. In Bido. And she deserves the world. I like that. Yes. All right. And this track shows you how talented exactly she is. She's not alone. DJ Kuchi is on it. But before that, let's say good morning to Francis Town on the count of three. One, two, three. Good morning, morning. Francis Town. Kalangaland. Kalangaland. <laughs> Just how nice song. Oh, very, very man. nice song. Yeah. But so, with Kuchi, again, mm-hmm. yeah. amazing talent. What do you expect, right? Amazing talent. Kuchi and our good friends. Yeah. Uh, Kuchi been dodging me, though, but that's okay. <laughs> that's okay. He's very shy, you know? He really is. Um, yeah. And whenever I'm with him, we have conversations. Him and I, we have we have dreams to work together one ah, day on a certain project. Dope. And uh, I think both you Remember us, to call me. Yes, I will. Yeah, I will, yeah, TK. And yeah. I think... I think both of us are still trying to just align it yeah to get to that to that yeah. place but we both have the goal i like that you you would allow things to align first you know yeah, sometimes when you push something. things no, yeah they something. break before they even form you know it's like ah, what what did we do and you know and your mental space you won't be there for it yeah yeah you won't be there for it so joan for the years that you're alive and we're blessed with your personality what are you giving this world that they should be excited for a, a good time. <laughs> a good time. A good time. You know, Woo. Um, I, I, my brand is a party girl. Yeah. And that's what I'm known for. Yeah. Um, I'm Do you on- feel like it's gonna, it's gonna stop at some point because of age or you're gonna be a party girl till you, you say bye bye? I believe. Yeah. That I will be a party girl until I die <laughs> for the simple reason that as age does come into play yeah. and uh, being a female as well yeah. in the industry, yeah. um, I will one day own a nightclub. Ah. And that is how the party girl will still continue. I love that. Yes, there'll be, there will be a new Gabs Diva. There'll be a new Gabs Diva doing my position. <laughs> um, but I will, I will always be in that nightclub and that party scene. I will always. I like that. It is, it's the most amazing feeling. Yeah. I, I've always given the example when you know you've created an event mm-hmm. and at midnight yes. you stand and you look and you're like, I brought all these people here. And they had a good time. There's no better feeling. There's no better time. feeling. It's 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 a high. Yeah, it's almost yeah. like a drug. And that, that was that first point that, that my sixth my, my eighteenth birthday with those six hundred people, I was like, How have you Shush, done this? Six hundred people. And I, I I've never looked back and, and that feeling will never go away from me. Yeah. Because I do it and I do it so often where I'm just, I mean, at the restaurant, yeah. we are clocking numbers that they've never even Dude. seen before. And I remember walking in with one of the DJs a couple of months ago. Uh-huh. And it, had, it was the most people we had ever seen at the restaurant. Wow. And I hardly drank anything that night because I was so overwhelmed Man. by how full it was. Yeah, yeah. And when I think of the fact that I just sent this out on my WhatsApp status. 
And everybody, in a week. And everybody came through. And everybody... Ah. Well, so much of that is coming your way. Thank you. You're still young. Yes. You're still Gab's diva. You're yes. still the party girl that we Thank love you. so much. And you did say, for the time that you're on this planet Earth... You're going to give us a good time. Yes. And a good time you did give us this morning. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. What a pleasure. It really was dope. And I was, I was, we were talking off air and we we're saying, look, there are a few people that come on this platform that is the Juice 2.0. Yes. That give us an organic conversation that's just really on point and we're having a good time. We forget we're on radio. It's pretty much, we could be anywhere else and have the same conversation. Yes, that is very, very true. So I appreciate you so much. Where can people find you if they want to follow you and interact with you? At Gabs Diva on all social media platforms. Yep. Gabs with an S. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Gabs Diva all on, on all social media platforms. All right. Thank you. you. Thank so you so much, TK. And I wish you all the best. Ah. And I hope that your journey continues. Thank you so much. And you much. learn to thrive and your team as well yeah. takes care of you. And you take care of them. I take care of them. I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> Gabs Diva, had a great time chilling with you. you. Until Thank next you. time, I bump into yes. you. Thank all right. You. Bye. <laughs> What's going on, YouTube? My name is TK of The Juice 2.0. I'm just here to say thank you very much for checking our video and click subscribe, like, and the notification button for more content just like that. Juicy content.